Hello my friends, it's time to break the law again. I talk so much about the scoop or the extension of the lead hand um, and every day still I meet golfers that tell me that uh, it's not possible, you can't hit it like that, it's going to be just high and short and, and now we're talking irons. But I need you to understand that the misunderstanding about the scoop or the flip it's not that we shouldn't do it, we should move it so it happens in the correct place. A bad scoop. We can do everything bad. A bad scoop happens before impact happens over here. If I do that, I will hardly hit. Hardly hit the ball. It's high, weak, no good. And I don't touch the ground. I just lift the ball in the air. It's not a good way to hit an iron. This is my trusty pitching wedge. So I don't want to flip before impact. I want to push the club into the ground and then flip, scoop. If you think about it, you want to get pressure, get just power into the ground. The ground is the key to a good impact when the ball is on the ground. The ground is the key to a good impact, not the ball. I don't really care about the ball. I care about landing the club, breaking the surface at the ball. If I do that, I can really push down. After impact, my scoop begins. So why do I even scoop? Because the other release, the rotation release, will close the club face so rapidly, I have no chance of finding my target. Maybe someone can with a sense of really good timing. I'm not that good, but with the scoop, I can really hit a good straight golf shot. So, same motion, but I'm pushing down and scoop afterwards. A little draw, a little, little, little divot, it's just perfect. So hitting it like this, you can watch, if you watch any tour play today, they all end up in the finish with the lead hand looking like that. They did the scoop, they did it after impact, not before. I don't know where this started. I mean, no, it doesn't look good. I mean, nobody wants to swing like this, lifting the ball. But we need to understand that some things that's bad before impact could be a really good thing after impact. The feeling you should have is very low here from the inside and a high finish. And if you scoop it, the high finish is almost for free because that motion brings the club up and not around. So hitting it decent straight is not that hard. From low to high includes the scope, scoop or flip, whatever you call it. So if you have problems with flip or scoop, keep it but move it so it happens in the correct place.